Hello, mister. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And, and you, teacher? I'm just fine. Just fine. Great. Okay. Tell me, what time did you get home today? Um, I are... I, I, <laughs> I got it, home. Uh, I got home um, early. 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 Yeah. What time? At six, at five? Early six, six thirty. Six thirty. Oh, that's okay. Six so theory, so. you have time to relax, to have dinner. Yeah, I I am I I have uh, also I I practice in, in the platform in, in the platform and I complete the the season sec, section four. Okay, you com I completed completed I completed the section four and and start to work in the section five. Okay, that means that you've been working a lot. Yes. That's um, great, that's great. In the, in the last test, I, I, ha, I, I, ha, I had a difficult really? about, about the listening. It's very, <laughs> it's very difficult. Um, Lograr escuchar bien, ¿cómo te dice? To be able to listen. To be a, a, able. To be able to listen. Yes, yeah, sometimes that happens. But you finish it. The, yeah, yeah, I, I completed it. That's excellent, that's excellent. And how was your day in general? Tell me. Yeah, it's... The Mondays always, um, always are, are, always are, um, tired. Really? Tired, yeah. Um, because I really love the last today, Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, Mondays are like tiresome. They are like a little bit more difficult. But yes. anyway, what can we do about it? No tenemos opción. <laughs> not the option. Yeah, there's not an option. We have to. That's the only option. You have to go to work. <laughs> yes. Okay, well. Nice talking to you, mister. Thank you, teachers. Same to. Okay, let's see. And hello, Miss Katya. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. How was your day, Katya? It was calm because oh. I stay at home today. I had, a, I had a meeting. Okay, how did the meeting go? How did the meeting go? Oh. Online? No. How did the meeting go? ¿Qué tal es tú? It, it was um, so a little boring. Oh, really? Because it was uh, Meeting the principals, directors. <laughs> oh, really? Just principals? But the education school. The. Uh -huh, sí. the escuelas especiales. Oh, really? Just the principals from special schools. And it was long because. Uh, 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 Nos hicieron muchas preguntas. They asked. They asked. They asked. 
they asked a lot of questions. A lot of questions. Oh, really? Well, that's the way it is. All the morning. All morning long. Oh my gosh. So you stayed in a meeting the whole morning? Yes, the whole morning. Wow. Must be difficult. And meetings tend to be kind of boring, actually. Yes. In this form is boring. Well, the good thing is that you are here in class, Miss. That's what matters right now. I want to feel like in a class. Yes. Yeah. It's funny here. <laughs> yeah, we can have fun. A lot of fun, actually. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let me check just something. I need to check out something that is somebody getting to me right here. Okay. So, what are Mondays usually like for you, Katia? ¿Cómo son los lunes para usted? Normal, like every day. I mean, they are not like more stressful, more difficult because I was talking to Umberto and he tells me, oh, Mondays no. are like, uh. No, because my time is, is, I don't know how to say, variable. Sometimes I, I go to Metapan, sometimes I go to Ministerio de Educación, sometimes I stay here in my house for me. No, they vary. It's not always yes. the same. Yes, always the same. That's cool, that's cool, actually. Realmente eso es bueno. No, no routine. Not the same routine, not the same stressful routine. That's nice. Okay, let's see. Well, thank you very much, Katia. Nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. What about you, Basilia? Hello, how are you? Hello, I'm fine. How was your day? Very good. Okay, and tell me, what did you do today? Mm, I do the house housework. Uh, housework. You did the housework. Oh, that's housework. cool. Yes. And um, what else did you do? Um, cook, clean, and practice in the platform, and help my son with the homework. Okay, that's cool. And oh, Mondays, Mondays are heavy for kids at school. Yes, my Monday on on Friday. The month. Yeah, Mondays are like that. Yeah, I can understand that. Well, thank you, Basilia. Nice talking to you. Let's see, Karen. Hello. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I am fine. You're fine. Yes. Okay. Okay, and tell me how was your day? It's a day very hot in Cojutepec. Everywhere, everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, the day has been terrible. Yes. Here in my house, it's hot, very hot today. But there's no option. And tell me, what did you do today, Karen? In at home. Uh, cleaning my house, uh, from school, cooking. Cooking, okay. What did you cook today? Uh, beans okay. and eggs the, in the dinner. Beans and? Eggs. Eggs, oh, that's cool. How do you yeah. like your eggs? How do uh, you like your eggs? Scramble? Uh, no sé cómo se dice picados. Scramble. Scramble. Yeah. Yeah. Scramble. That's 
I mean, you say scrambled eggs. It's, it's scrambled eggs. Yep. Yeah. Okay. What else did you prepare? Just that. Uh, and yes, no more. Is that okay? Now, uh, another way to say to prepare eggs. Oh, what about do you like eggs and uh, sunny side up? Do you like sunny side up? Eggs. ¿Qué le parece a los huevos sunny side up? Eh, no idea. Sé. No. Okay, sunny eh, means soleado. Side es lado. Up es hacia arriba. Okay. So, what idea do you get? ¿Qué, qué idea le da? Como... No, no sé, teacher. Estrellado. Estrellado. Ah, ok. That would eh, be sunny side up. I don't like. You don't like them? No. Oh, come on. They're good. I like them hard over. Some people like them easy over. Algunas personas le gustan easy over. That means, uh, con la cosita esa, the one in the middle, ¿cómo se llama la cosa de medio? La yema. La yema. Okay. Some people like that soft. Le gusta suave. I like it hard over. I don't like it. Well cooked. Yeah, I like it, but well cooked. Para mí está bien, pero muy cocida. Okay, well. Nice talking to you, Karen. Thank you. You're welcome. Lillian. Hello, Lillian. Lillian. Hello, hello. Sorry, teacher. Creo que tengo problemas un poco con el audio. De mi compu. Oh, really? Well, no problem, no problem. This, there's Oscar here. Well, was Oscar here? Oh my gosh, I'm having problems with connection. I need to disconnect everything. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, guys, today we are going to keep on working with the descriptions. Let me just remind everybody that it's time already. Solo déjenme recordarles a todos que ya es hora. Because more people should be here right now. La gente debería estar acá ahora. In some places I know that it's starting to rain. En algunos lugares es que comienza a llover. Okay, we are going to continue describing people and situations, but we're going to focus on people. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Do you remember that you were describing something? Just give me a second, please. Give me a second. I'm sorry. My apologies. Okay, let's continue. What was I telling you? Oh, we are going to describe people. Okay, we're going to be describing people today and we are going to be to continue describing people because we did it last class. But before we move on, I want to check out how are we doing with the platform? Oscar, hello, how are you? Hello, hello, teacher. How are you, mister? I'm so, um, um, I have a hate. <laughs> a what? Ah, uh, uh, you can say it is hot. Uh huh. It is hot. 
Okay. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's terrible. I got a fan here, and the problem is that I got the air conditioner, but in the other rooms. <laughs> I so, <get> a lot. <laughs> yeah, so that's a problem for me because here, where I got my studio, there's no air conditioner. I got it in the other in the bedrooms. I got air conditioner. So here I am suffering. Acá estoy sufriendo. Yeah, it's yeah, I only um, ventilador. I'm, I'm sorry. I got the fan. Yeah, me too. I have a fan. Okay, I I I, I have a fan. In only I no have a a condition. <laughs> me neither. Here, where I am right now, I just have one fan. In my bedroom, well, in the bedrooms is where I got air conditioner and los dormitorios es donde tengo. So right now I am suffering. It's terrible. I understand you, mister. Now tell me, Oscar, eh, do you remember you were describing people the other day? ¿Se recuerda que estábamos describiendo personas? Yes, I remember. Uh, I, don't, I don't have a class. A class, class. Okay. Can you describe somebody for us, please? Whatever person. Yeah, whoever. Okay, my son. My son. Your son, he, perfect. He, okay, my son is, uh, hair is um, blonde hair. Okay. And it's a fat. And it's a fat. de la pandemia. Okay. Fat. Hyperactive. Okay, he's a hyper. <laughs> hyperactive. He's not a parent. Yeah. Kills. Kills. Like, nowadays like are like that. Kills. Nowadays. Oh, okay. Kills. Nowadays are like that. Nowadays means hoy en día. Yeah. <laughs> it's correct. Yeah. yeah, they are like that. Well, thank you, Oscar. Welcome to the class. Let's see who else do we have. Linda, hello, welcome. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Linda. How are you? Fine, thanks, teacher. Tell me, how was your weekend, Linda? Um, uh, very nice. Really? I Why? Go, what did you do? I, I go to the beach. I went. I went to the beach. Oh, really? Where did you go? Uh, San Blas. San Blas. San Blas is beautiful. Yeah. But it's been hot. Terribly hot. <laughs> yeah. Mm, no. A little hot this Sunday. On Sunday. Okay. Okay. What did you have for lunch yesterday? Tell me. A big fish? um cocktail cocktails cocktail oh really what yeah. shells shrimps fish shark and um, a uh, camarón shrimp 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 i love i love ceviches but i like them from a uh, shark yeah, shark, shark is my favorite. El de tiburón es mi favorito. That's delicious for me. Nunca lo he probado. Picture. Oh. El tiburón. Yeah. Nice. En serio. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, I don't know the word in English. It's una carne magra. It's good. Very tasty. Yeah. I like it. Well, nice talking to you, Linda. Welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Me too. Hey, Carlos. Hello. How are you? You're fine. And you? I'm just great. Just great. How was your day, mister? Very good. Thank you. Really? And tell me, what did you do during the weekend? How was the weekend for you? 
I um, I I did play soccer. Oh, you went to play soccer? Yes. That's nice. Actually, that's great. Did you win? Always. Oh, that's cool. That's the attitude. That's the attitude. Excellent. Excellent. Shrimp, Oscar, that means uh, camarones. Okay. So you win. Excellent. Tell me what was the score? What was the score? Excuse me, teacher. I, I not understand. What was the score? Resultado. Um, I, I not remember, but. Uh, uh, very, very goals. Oh, many goals. Yes. Many. Yes. Muchos. Yes. Okay. You know, when you sometimes you win, sometimes you win. Sometimes you lose. A veces ganamos, a veces perdemos. And sometimes in soccer you tie. You know that word tie? Tie actually it's a, a corbata. That's tie. But when you are talking about scores, tie means empatar. That word also means empatar. The word means uh, actually got three meanings. Tiene tres significados. Corbata, eh, amarrar, atar, and if it's about soccer, about a game, eh, empatar. En well, este caso, teacher, dependerá entonces de lo que se está hablando. ¿no? Context, yes. Context. According to context. Let's see. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Adonai. Hello. How are you, mister? Fine. How was your day, mister? Um, I, 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 I'm working. You are working right now? I was working. Oh, okay, okay. And tell me, what about the weekend? Last weekend, el fin de semana, what did you do? Um, I got to the church. I went, I went to church. See, I went to, uh -huh, I went to the, the church and Uh, I play with with children. Okay, that's excellent. That's excellent. Now, thank you very much, yeah. mister. Thank you, gracias. I want to explain something to you guys. Look, look in the chat. Ven en el chat. Going to the church. Okay. Okay, you got two different expressions. Tenemos dos expresiones. I went to church and I went to the church. What's the difference? There's a difference. They two mean something a little bit different. Significan algo un poquito distinto. When you say, I went to church, you are speaking in general, okay? Oh, I went to church. It could have been a Catholic, Christian. Uh, it could have been a Jehovah Witnesses. Anyone, cualquiera. Okay, when I say I went to church, you don't know which church. Ustedes no saben que church or religion or creed o credo, right? But when I say, imagine that I'm talking to Katia and I tell her, hey, Katia, look, I went to the church yesterday. Oh, in this conversation, Katia already knows which church do I attend. Cuando yo le digo a Katia, hey, Katia, yo fui a la iglesia. She knows, ella sabe. Which one? At what? At least their religion, okay? But if I'm talking in general, like with you, you don't know which church do I attend. Ustedes no saben a cual yo vi, yo uh, asisto, eh, attend. So I say, oh, I went to church, okay? 
That's in general. Is it clear? ¿Se entendió? Yes? Yes. Excellent, excellent. Well, 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 guys. Now, look, we are going to watch a video. Do you remember I told you to watch two videos? Les pedí que viéramos dos videos, right? During the weekend. Yes? Two videos that were, go that were going to help us to, to develop the exercises from the class. We are going to watch the first one here, and then we are going to do an activity in pairs. Vamos a ver el primero y luego haremos una actividad. Welcome, Emily. Welcome, Elizabeth. And bueno. Felino. Hello. Well, Hello, teacher. Let me share with you guys. Where is it? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. It's not quite ready yet. It's here. Okay, here we go. Remember, we are in the English Corporativo platform. We are in section four. What does she look like? The video describing people. We are going to watch it right now. Hi, in this lesson, you will learn how to describe, ask and answer questions about appearance. Let's go over the audio program. Notice the questions they use to ask for the information needed. Describing people. General appearance. What does she look like? She's tall with red hair. She's gorgeous. Does he wear glasses? Yes, and he has a beard. Age. How old is she? She's about 32. She's in her 30s. How old is he? He's in his 20s. Height. How tall is she? She's 1 meter 88. She's 6 feet 2. How tall is he? He's quite short. Hair. How long is her hair? It's medium length. What color is his hair? It's dark brown. It's light brown. He has brown hair. When you want to know how someone is physically, we use what look like. For age-related questions, we use how old. For height, we use how tall. The rest of the question will depend on who you're talking about. Age. Okay, guys, let's see. Oh, my God. Perfect. Now, you see these questions? What does he look like? What does she look like? Does he wear glasses? How old is she? How old is he? Let's see, Katia, please open your mic. Katia, hello. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Katia, please tell me uh, the name of one member of your family. Mm. Who is that? Your mother? Your My sister? Mother. Okay. Tell me, what does she look like? Um, she's pretty. Okay. Tell me, does she wear glasses? Yes. She wears. She does. She does. How old is she? She's uh, 71 years old. Oh, that's nice. And um, tell me, what is her height? How tall is she? Um, she's... Um, uh, How tall? Estatura. Um, about one, I don't know. One meter? Mm -hmm. Or you can tell me she's short, she's tall, she's medium high? Medium, medium high. Thank you. What color is her hair? Um, her hair is brown. Oh, perfect. Or brown. 
Excellent. Thank you very much, Katia. Thank you, teacher. Okay, guys. Do you listen to the exercise? Yes? Okay. We are going to do the same exercise, working in pairs. You are going to, to say the member of, the name of one member of your family. Van a trabajar en parejas. Van a decir el nombre de un miembro de la familia. And then the other person is going to start asking. Ok. You are going to choose who asks and who answers. Ustedes escogen quién pregunta y quién responde. Ok. And then we are going to perform it here. Luego voy a escoger algunas parejas para que lo hagan acá. Ok. Is it clear? Yes. ¿Se entendió? Okay, perfect. Hey, Reynaldo, welcome. I'm sorry I didn't say hi. Let me see. I'm going to create the groups. Let me get a group. One, two, three. Okay, perfect. Groups are created. Please jump in. How old is he? He is uh, 50 years old. 50? 50? Yes. Okay. Okay. Es mi sobrino. Sobrino. A ver si. Un time. Sí, verdad. Bye. And what does he look like? Ah, he is cute. He is cute. Yeah. Okay, and how old is he? He's four years old. Oh, he's a child. Yes. Sometimes he came here and uh, hug, me. hug me. Hug me. Hug me. Yes. He loves oh, yes. me. And, and what color is his hair? His hair is black. He, he I'm sorry. Eh, lindo, para decir lindo. Cute, cute. Ah, cute, 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 y cute. How, so, how old is he? Uh, he four years old. Oh, how tall is he? Um, he one meter uh, 15 centimeters. How, ay, pero este quizás no va para él. How long? Is her his hair? Um, he is black hair. Has, so look in, oh, his uh, hair is black. Is black. He has or his hair is black. Ah, uh, hair is black. 
Ah, pero es que dice, how long is his hair? Short or mm. long? Short. Muy poquito tiempo. Don't worry, don't worry. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, Jose Lino, please ask the questions to Katia. Okay. Hello, Katia. I was talking about my nephew. Your nephew, oh, perfect. You. What's his name, Katia? His name is Diego. Diego. Okay, please, Jose, ask her. Okay, how old is he? He's four years old. And what does he look like? He's, he's tall. For his age. For his age. And is is very cute, or cute. Okay, what color is his hair? His hair is black. And what color is his eye? Are his eyes? Are his eyes? His, his eyes are brown. Mm. That's it. Um, only. <laughs> okay, perfect. How old did you say he was, Katia? Uh, how old is He's four years old. Four years old. Oh, a little kid. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Jose. Thank you, Katia. Perfect. Well done. Now, let's see. Let's see. Next group is. Uh, Basilia and Mr. Carlos. Okay, who's going to ask? And who's going to answer? I the answer. Okay, so Mr. Carlos is going to ask you. Please, mister. Okay. Who are you going to describe, Basilia? I'm sorry. I describe my husband. Okay. Please, mister. Go ahead. Okay, the first question. Um, what does he look like? He's a tall. He has a black tail. And he's a mustache. He Okay, and how old is he? He. He speaks. He is fifty years old. Okay. How tall is he? Uh, he is one meter sixty-five. Sixty-five. Uh, sixty-cinco. Sixty-five. You say 165. 165. Perfect. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Carlos. Excellent. Well done. Now, let's see. Next one. Humberto and Reinaldo. Okay. Who's going to ask and who's going to answer? I ask. Okay. Please, go ahead. Uh, who's, who is it going to be described? I described to my wife. Okay, perfect. What does she look like? She's, she's a pretty woman. Okay. How old is she? She has um, 41 years old. She, she, has. Uh, she has. 
Uh, how tall is she? Uh, she she's a middle middle height. Um, how long is her hair? Her, her hair is a middle short. Um, what color is her hair? He hair her hair. Her hair is um, light brown. Only questions? Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Thanks. Excellent. Now, uh, let me just, oops, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Now I'm going to clarify something because there was a question that was asked to me. Me hicieron una pregunta and I want to, uh, 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 I want to make a, a, to clarify it. Okay. The word mustache, uh, you can write it two different ways. Escribe dos maneras distintas. Okay. You can say mustache, that's British English. Or you say mustache. That's American, but the most, the most, the most, the most proper is mustache. In the platform, I don't remember. In the platform, no sé cuál es la que le usan. Usan most con. Mustache. Second one. Second one without the U, sin la U, verdad? With you, only you, most. Oh yeah, most. I'm sorry, que escribí yo. Oh, my bad. Mustache, like this. Yeah. Okay. Now you can have the you can have mustache mustache. That's British. That's British. Is it French? It's just a little variation. The problem is this. Look, uh, uh, how can I explain this? And I'm so sorry. Sometimes that happens to me. It's like. Uh, uh, that happens to me with some words like uh, theater. Look, I write it, I usually write it here, but in America people write it like this. In the Estados Unidos, they lo escriben de la segunda manera, theater. And in my case, I say theater. Okay. The problem is that one of my first teachers was Scottish. The problem is that one of my first teachers was Scottish. So I got many words like that. But I'll try it along the course. I'll try to make the to clarify with you when it's British and when it's American. Cuando en algunas ocasiones las palabras cambian, se las voy a ir aclarando. ¿Cuál es la pronunciación o el spelling American and cuál es el American? Okay? Because it, with some little words it changes, like a, like flat, flat, and apartment. In the in England you say flat, in the Terra says flat. In the United States you say apartment, okay, and they are the same. It's the same, okay. And some uh, there are some ideas that are like uh, weird. Algunas son un poquito raras. Like uh, if you got a if you go to a building, si te un edificio, okay, there's the there's the Para nosotros está el primer piso, segundo piso, third floor, like, right? ¿Verdad? In the United States, you got it exactly the same. En Estados Unidos se lo lleva igual. The first floor is al que entramos desde la calle, the second, the third. In England, uh -uh. in Inglaterra, no. You have the lobby and the first floor es lo que para nosotros es el segundo. Okay. But that's just in England. Okay. Just little details, okay? Little details. I'll try to get them to you. As soon as I identify one, I'll try to explain it to you. Tan pronto los identifique, se los iré diciendo. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue. I'm sorry, guys. Let's see. Let's see. That was uh, Reynaldo and Humberto. Perfect. Well done, both of you. Now, Elizabeth you. and Linda. Okay, Elizabeth and Linda, who's going to ask? Okay. Okay, este, Elizabeth, who, who is going to describe? My son. 
Ok, este... Um, what does he look like? Mm. He, he is beautiful. He is short. What does he look like? He is beautiful, she said. Ok. Uh, how, how old is he? He, he is four years old. What color I a are eyes? His eyes. Uh, his eyes. Perfect. He has black. Black are eyes. Eyes. How tall is he? He is one meter fifteen. Okay. okay. Perfect. Thank you very much. Let's see who's going to be next. Uh, that was Elizabeth. Now let's see. Let's see. Karen and Oscar. Where's Oscar? Hello. Okay. Who's I'm going in, to ask? In my group, is three persons. Yes, but you will do it right now with Karen. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Uh, I, I have a question for. And what does he look oh, like? Where is the person? Who is the person? Oh, the person is his son. Her son. Her son. Her son. Okay, perfect. Please continue. Okay, what does he look like? He is intelligent. He's very funny. And she, he's uh, gorgeous. 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 Oh. How is he? He's ten years old. Okay. How is tall? How tall is he? Ah, sorry, sorry. He is a tall, tall. How tall is he? She, she can say it like that. She can say he is tall. That's okay. I don't want to decide, but you can say that the, the actual height was it like pure exact, or you can say he's tall, he's short. Ah, okay. It's average. It's okay. Okay. Um, how long is how long is uh, his hair? Uh, he's a uh, hair short. Short hair. What oh. the color is? Uh, uh, the color is black. Okay. Thank you. Excellent. Well done, both of you. Now, Emily. Hello, Emily. Let's see. Oh, she's there. Hi, teacher. Hello, Emily. You are going to work with Herlin. Hello, Herlin. Hi, teacher. Hi. Okay, let's see. I'm going to flip a coin. Let's see. Uh, Herlin, you are going to ask Emily. Okay. okay. Emily, who are you going to describe? I describe my mo my mother. Okay, she's going to okay. describe her mother. Please. Okay. What does she look like? She's short and very funny. She have uh, has uh, curly short hair and black. Oh. And she's very talkative. talkative. Okay, talkative. And she's very cute. Okay. And how old is she? Uh, she's in her 40s. Okay. And how tall is she? She's very short. Ah, okay. How long is her? Is her hair? Her. He has a uh, short hair. Ah, what color is his hair? Hair. Hair. The color is black. Ah, okay. Okay, thanks. Perfect. Thank you very much. Very well done. Both of you. Well, actually, all of you. You see, to describe somebody, it's easy. And to ask the question is very 
simple. And remember, when as we are using WH questions, we are very we are being very specific. Like what color? Okay. So that helps us to, to, to be specific with the question. Now let's see. We need to watch the other video about the conversation and let me share with you. Okay, we go back to the platform, but now we go to section number 4.10. Which one is she? Okay, let's listen to the conversation, please. I am so sorry, I think that The internet connection is a little bit slow today. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Well, let's wait a minute because the internet, like sometimes that happens with the platform, the video gets like stopped well let's see let's see we are talking about the adjectives to describe people okay so if you see they are uh, they were very very simple now but adjectives can also be used to describe besides people to describe places okay now tell me katia please would you mind describing your school what does your school look like It is um, big or small? It's small. It's my small school. Okay, and tell me, is it it's a, a yes? It's an old house. Okay. Old house, and um, but there is a little student. Few a few students. A few students. A few students. Um, but it's beautiful. Okay, there excellent. Are many plants, flowers, and, and two, three, three uh, almendras. Three. Okay, there are, there are. Almond trees. Almond tree in the patio. <laughs> in the, uh, well, it depends. There's a difference, okay? You have patio and you have jar, okay? You have jar. If you say jar, it's uh, dirt. If they say jar, it's porque es un patio de tierra, okay? If you say patio or patio, it's because it got cement. Porque tiene uh, cemento, ok? Ok, there is, oh, there are, is a, a, a kitchen. Ok. Beautiful kitchen. Oh, nice. Um, uh, comedor. Dining room. Well, How actually, it's a lunch area, right? In this case, it's a uh, lunch, lunch area. And um, there is a taller. A workshop? Workshop. Piñatería. Oh, really? You do piñatas? Piñatas. Oh, the, nice. With handicap, uh, the, no. It works as a therapy, I imagine. Oh, really, that's nice. Excellent. Thank you very much, Katia. Okay, let's see. Where's Emily? Emily, hello. Hi, teacher. Emily, please describe your house to me. 
and my house is a uh, um, big bigger house. Small, small house. Um, small house because um, it it is or it has not much secret. Because only have uh, only has yes three um, rooms yes 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 three rooms okay yeah. and, um I have a garden oh uh, nice a small garden and a big garage because in there uh, in there um cabin okay fit fit in there fit for uh, cars oh my gosh it's big yeah because my father is an he is an importer oh that's why interesting well thank you very much emily yes perfect linda okay linda please describe your living room <laughs> let's get over <laughs> my li my living room is small okay is um uh um has a sofa 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 a uh, three sofa um tv okay what color uh, is it uh, white okay and tell me is it fresh is a fresh room or a hot room a little fresh because um in the in medio in the middle in the middle um eh, has a entrada de aire oh really yeah oh my gosh that's nice beautiful yeah. okay and tell me eh, 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 what color is your floor what color are the floors it's, it's a uh, black it's a uh, white Oh, yeah, I was like, I love black floors, but mm, for the living room, <laughs> they're like, mm, yeah. not good for illumination. Correct. Thank you very much, Linda. Thank you, teacher. Now, Basilia, please, Basilia, describe your kitchen to me. My kitchen is a little. Okay. Small, um, small. Ah, uh, small. Um, has a refrigerator and a stove. And uh, what do you say, pantry? A pantry, yes. A, a pantry. Um, the wash the dishes, but no machine. And what's the dishes? Yeah, 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 yeah. You mean a a a a trasto. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, hold on, just give me a second. Uh, I know what you mean. It's, uh, it's actually a dishwasher. Dishwasher, okay. Yes. Only that. Okay, perfect, that's nice. Tell me, do you have many cabinets? Yes, I have many cabinets. And... Are they wide or narrow? Why yes? Wide. What is the wide? Look at me. Wide or uh, narrow? No. It's wide. No, wide. Wide. In the. Uh, what do you say? Arriba. In the upper. In, in the, the upper. Upper. Hold on. In the upper part or in the, in the upper, upper section. 
This in the upper part in Abba. That's down. down. Down part. Yeah. Oh, in this case, uh, in este caso, no es down. Down is hacia abajo. In this case, mm -hmm. is the bottom. Bot I'm sorry, yeah. bottom. My bad. Perdón. With a name. Bottom. Bottom. In the bottom. Yeah. Es la parte de abajo o el fondo de algo. Ok. Okay. Y si es ya el, la última parte, es de top. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much, Basilia. Interesting. Let's see, Reynaldo. Hello, mister. You've been very quiet today. Uh, Reynaldo, I don't please. participate. <laughs> please describe okay. your office to me. My office, oh, or your cubicle is is terrible, terrible discretion for me right now, Why? because uh, the last week I um, translate my office uh, to the how do you say sotano? Okay, moved, not translate, moved, moved to the basement. Basement moved to the basement. Moved to the basement oh. because in the in the floor in the fifth floor. Yeah, uh, is uh, there are remodelation? Oh, really? They yes. are remodeling. They are remodeling. Uh, remodeling. Yes. Oh, right now, in the in the basement, uh, there are many rooms. Some uh, very tall or very excuse me, very short. Another very big. Oh, in my case, my office, there are in the short, very short. Okay, in este caso, si usted me dice short, me está diciendo corto. What you mean is small, pequeño. Yeah, it's small. Um, yes, short and, and short, short and small. Oh, okay. because, because the, how do you say division? Yeah, yeah, the division. The, the division, the division is, is not very tall. Oh, it's very okay. short and it's very hot. <laughs> oh, yeah. so sorry to hear that, Mr. Well, interesting description. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, let's see. Let's see who's going to be next. Hmm. Karen, Karen, please describe your living room. Hello, Karen. Oops, we don't hear her. Then let's see, let's see. Harleen, hello, Harleen, can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Please, Harleen, describe your living room. My living room, um, there is a, um, I don't know the. Uh, it's big, it's a small. And it is a small. Okay. Um, what color is it? It's green, the color is green. Okay, and hold on. What? Hold on. And does it have a ceiling? Tiene cielo? Yes. Okay. What color? We is had the a false on here. Is white. The color is white. Okay. Ceiling. Ceiling. Ceiling means cielo uh, falso. Can you say? Uh, I think it's false heaving. No, no. No, no, no. Yes. Ceiling. Just ceiling. Ceiling. Okay. Okay. Perfect. And tell me. Uh, do you have a big TV or a small TV? Um, medium. Medium. I had a medium medium TV. Okay, interesting. And tell me, do you like big sofas or small sofas? 
we have a small sofa. Okay. And is your sofa yeah. old style or modern? Old star. Old style. Yes, old oh, style. Yeah, moderns for me are uncomfortable. Para mí los modernos no son tan cómodos. Thank you very much, Helen. <laughs> okay, thanks. Okay, guys, now for tomorrow, just a little extra activity, una actividad extra chiquitita. I need you to please, well, tomorrow we are going to do the conversation for good. Mañana hacemos la conversación porque la hacemos. That's one. The other one is this. Uh, I would like you to choose a place from your house or your workplace to describe, okay? A short description. You don't need to make it too big, okay? Something very short. Hey guys, thank you very much. It was a nice class. Time flies. El tiempo voló. I really like to share with you this class. Thank you very much. Thanks for being here. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. See you tomorrow, good teacher. Good thank night. you. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. I, I take a question in WhatsApp. Okay, let me see. Okay, you're going to send me a question. Me va a mandar una pregunta. I think so. Well, bye-bye, guys. Bye. Bye.